the summer handicap hurdle is next this is a listed hurdle and it's over two miles and one furlong this time and it's 0 to 140 top one is practice for james shea fiorenti paul rhodes snug fit valediction james shea argira darren thompson portland harbour Vinnie Gerard, Jamal Hill, Camera, Alex Cherry, Turbo Jet, Red Eyes, Annie's Land, Alex Cherry, Solomon Fiction, Thomas Rogers, and Towel Beer Saved for Dan Hughes. Ten of the men off and racing through the murk and the gloom and the rain as Argira disputes the early lead with Jamal Hill, Camera. Fear into just tucked in behind them, but they're very tightly packed at this early stage in the race. They've got ten flights to take in all this time. And they are power into the first, which they've all got over nicely. With the sort of made fiction, just the early back marker as they get over the second. And Alex Cherry's got a 1 2 at the moment with Annie's Land and Jamalville camera. Then our gear a third and Fiorenti fourth. And practice in Portland Harbour as they get over the third. Also, if we go with that, with Tell Beer saved just a little bit detached now at the back. But they're going along with a good old clip, and Annie's Land is three clear of Argira, Fiorenti, and Jamalville Camera. In Snug Fit Valediction and Practice Wider on the track, Turbo Jet and the Pale Colours. In between Portland Harbour and Solomade Fiction, Tell Beer saved the one who's just out of shot. But Annie's Land. It's four lengths clear of the chasers. And those chasers are headed by Argira as they get to the fourth. So they all managed to get over nicely. Jockey on his land, have a little look around, see how far in front he is. He's a good five clear as he takes the fifth. The rest of them are covered by only about three lengths, with the exception of Talbia Saves. So as they come past the stand, then, and they've got another circuit to go yet. The crowd will wave them on as they pass the winning post. Then, with just a little over a mile to go, this pretty tight track. And Annie's Land is the leader by a bad five or six lengths to practice. Who's gone second? Our gear is third, and Fiorenti is four. And Jamal Camera still got the rail. Tell me a save there. You can see just getting into shot is not that far away and appears to be closing as well. So wide open race this one. Um, Annie's land landed over that one in the lead. From Jamalville, Camera, Argear and Fiorenti. And over the seventh they go and now all of a sudden they're all coming to challenge Annie's land and Argear hits the front. Argear then takes it up with three to jump from Annie's land in second. Fiorenti is third. Then Jamalville, Camera, Turbo Jet and Practice now making their move. Also Snookfit, Valediction is there. Sort of had fiction's not out of it either as they get over to third from home. And our gear is in front from Annie's land trying to battle back. Jamalville camera comes off the fence and now swings around the outside to come through and join the leader. But it's our gear in front still from Jamalville camera. Annie's land, snug fit valediction up the centre of the track. Turbo jet looks to be going well. Solomade fiction is looking for a dream split up the inside. But it's our gear up. Who's just about a head in front then with two to jump from Jemimaville camera on the one side and on the inside Annie's land turbo jets after that one then snug fit one addiction fear into and solid made fiction surely between these are Portland Harbour and practice and Tullabia Sabre still trying to run on over the second last they go Jemimaville camera made a mistake our oh, gear it wasn't foot perfect turbo jet now really powering on the turbos up the center of the track as they race down towards the final flight then over it they go it's our gear who lands in the lead from Jemimaville camera and turbo jet is a full on and our gear is beginning to top up Turbo Jet and Jamalville Camera are beginning to challenge him and Turbo Jet zoomed into the lead and Turbo Jet is going off like a Turbo Jet and takes it on the line Turbo Jet wins it Jamalville Camera our gear snug fit prediction and then Vierinti after that one all the way back to practice and Turbo Jet turned on the burners as they took the final flight took it by a good length in the end so Turbo Jet takes it for Red Eyes, Jemimaville Camera for Alex Cherry was second, Argira for Darren Thompson third, Snook Fit Valediction for James Shea was fourth, and Fiorenti for Paul Rhodes was fifth.